What if we were stuck like that? Like really stuck. What is it called? Like um, like the cat, the cat word. Siamese. Siamese. Twins. If we were Siamese like this, would you want to be the one that walked and I would <laughs> I would balance, or would, should I walk and you balance? <laughs> we can't both walk. That's not. I don't think that would look good, normal enough. I like you. I like you more than I've ever liked anyone. This is nice. Mom, listen to me. I want you to understand. It was a year ago. I want to tell it to you. It's important to me. Just stop. Everything's gonna be okay. Do you need some, um, John time? Bobby Sue and I aren't dating. Neither were we. Oh yeah, that's right. You and John went to state together, right? What class? African philosophy and cosmology. You remind yourself of the first time you met, how nice he used to be, how nice I thought you were, and then the kiss. And after the kiss, little changes. Small, you, you can't put your finger on it. You kissed me first. When I saw him for the first time, he looked like the poster boy for the Boy Scouts of America. I just want to love him. That's all I care about. I can't eat. I haven't been thirsty in over a month. I, I drink water, but there's no thirst. This is killing you. It's easy to care when someone's sick, right? Isn't it odd how it's hard to care when it's just someone who loves you? John, did Epo tell you she's sick? If you had the choice, would you want to be a boy? A little boy? Do you want to be a real man? Um, I consider myself a man. Oh, do you? Because, because I think, I think a real man has integrity. I think a real man is honest and forthcoming. And treats women with respect. And acts at a moral campus to the individuals within his circle of influence. So you want me to talk to her? Bring the girls to Yosemite this weekend. I don't know how I'm a coward, because I'm on the most ridiculous road trip of all time, with two girls who are both mad at me, and one of those people has a guinea pig. I think I'm the bravest man that I know. John's in his own head a lot, and that's okay, I like that. I think I'm that way too. He told me you weren't boyfriend, girlfriend yet. You were just friends. He deserves someone to be patient for him. People have hard times. And people need you to be there for them, you know? I just don't love you. Did you know that before or after you slept with me? You're supposed to be her friend. I told her I was sorry. And if she doesn't want to listen to that or anything else that I've ever said, what am I, how do I fix that? What am I supposed to do about that? You focus on things that don't matter. If you can't be stupid and naive and overly trusting with your friends, it's time to move on. And for the record, I said I'm sorry doesn't count as an apology.